Hey YouTube! So, welcome to Pregnancy Week 6! I am six weeks pregnant. Actually today, I totally suck at life and I haven't been able to record. I am actually right now six weeks and five days. I'm almost to seven weeks. I apologize. So let me fill you in on a little bit about what's happened in, since I filmed last week. I ended up going in on Friday. I had used the bathroom Friday morning and when I wiped, not even going to lie, I am a total toilet paper checker. Like, I check the toilet paper every time I go to the bathroom and I think that's just part of my anxiety from the miscarriage and it just worries me. Well, I checked my toilet paper and I was spotting. So I immediately freaked out and I was panicked and at first I was like, well maybe it's not, I don't know, let me just check and I used like a Q-tip and I just kind of, you know, swabbed inside of my, you know, my JJ. and when I pulled the Q-tip out there was blood on it. So I knew at that point that it was actual vaginal bleeding and I called my husband at work and I was bawling hysterically and I was in like a complete panic. I called my midwife's office like immediately and um, they told me to come right in. So I did and she told me, I, I went right in and she took me back to her room and she was like, look, I'm not even going to check you. She was like, we're going to go straight for ultrasound because that's going to tell us everything that we need to know. And I'm like, okay. I like my hands were shaking. I was an emotional disaster. All I'm thinking is, here we go again. And I went in and she did the ultrasound and there was a heartbeat. So I'm going to insert the video clip that I have because my husband had to stay here with my daycare kids so that I could go to the appointment. So I videoed the heartbeat for him so that he could see it too. So here it is now. Thank you. Uh -huh. Okay, so there's my little teeny beans, little flickering, flickering heartbeats. And if you listened in the video, you could hear me say, I'm sorry, my hands are shaking because my hands were shaking really bad. So from that appointment, my midwife went ahead and decided to put me on progesterone. And I told her I think that the, my biggest problem was the fact that I don't, I should say, I'll catch you up in a minute. But at that time, I did not feel pregnant. I wasn't tired. I wasn't having any sickness. I just didn't feel pregnant besides, like, the bloating of my stomach. But other than that, I didn't, I mean, nothing. I'm, you know, on Baby Center, and I see all these women that are always posting, oh, I'm so sick, and I knew I was pregnant because I started throwing up at, like, four weeks and a day. And I didn't have any of that. So since then... I started taking the progesterone, and that was an ordeal all in itself, trying to find that, um, because it's a compound that has to be made, and apparently there's like one pharmacy in my area that's like over an hour away. So, <clears throat> my husband went and picked that up for me before our big snowstorm hit that we got here, where I live. And since then, Saturday I started feeling nauseous, Monday I actually really got sick. Um, we were grocery shopping at Target, and I ran and had to run into the bathroom, and let me just tell you, like Target, the bathroom was clean, but whatever they used to clean and deodorize the air, oh, it just pushed me over the edge, and I vomited everywhere. And you know, there really are still nice people in this world, because as I was throwing up, this woman comes in, and I'm like hey, um, you know, I'm throwing up, and I'm like, I'm not contagious, I'm pregnant. And she gave me cold paper towels, so that was really cool. But I am getting ready to leave to go see my midwife and do another ultrasound to make sure that my little bean is still has a beautiful heartbeat and it's still flickering away. And I should be six weeks and five days today. And hopefully, fingers crossed, everything is still healthy. But I will update you when I get back. So see you then. Bye. Hey, so I'm in the room and I'm waiting. Oh yeah, so fun, so fun. 
waiting. Because closed. Fit for him. So I'll, I've had it frozen fine. right this second. So you're six weeks and two days today by this. How, what day did you come last week? I was five weeks, six days last week. And that was um, at um, Friday. So Friday, and we're it's at been a week Thursday yeah. right now. So we're right around the same place. Look at its little beating heart. I know. Cracks me up. And measure one more time. Is the yolk sac getting smaller? Nope, it should no. be about the same size right now. Oh, okay. Yep, so right around the same place that we, you know, have been. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey YouTube, okay, so let me catch up really quickly on my midwife appointment and let you know that later today I will be doing my seven week because I have not had a chance to catch you guys up on my midwife appointment because I haven't had time to record. So <clears throat> when I went to see my midwife last Thursday, she um, did another ultrasound and the baby measured six weeks and three days, which was two days less than what um, I should have been, but I'm guessing that's normal because she said that was fine. But the baby had a heart rate, and she was actually able to count it this time, and it was 160 beats per minute. So everybody keeps telling me, it's a girl, it's a girl, it's a girl, but we're not going to find out. So hmm, September's going to be a really long time to wait. But um, so far, I am very sick. I'm still very sick, and I'm very, very tired. Uh, the exhaustion level, I think, is more than I expected it to be because it's like an all-day exhaustion. Um, it's a struggle for me to stay awake at nap time now with my daycare kids. Um, I'm like turning on movies that I've never seen so that I stay awake and watch them and trying to keep myself like awake. Um, not cleaning or anything because I can't, I'm just bleh, mm -mm, not good. So other than that, so far everything's been good. And I can't show you my belly this week because I'm on my phone and um, I don't know if it'll actually work um, to try to show you, but and it's kind of not fair to show you my belly because technically now I'm seven weeks, so um, I'll show you my belly in my seven week video. But I do think I have a picture, so I'll insert that at the end and use it as like my little thumbnail for my video. So I don't know. Everything so far so good. The progesterone's okay. It's very messy. Not a big fan. I am sick, I'm tired, and I'm still pregnant, so I'm actually welcoming all of my symptoms. I love them. I just have to get through them. So, okay ladies, so thank you for following me. Remember, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, or follow me on Facebook. Um, the link will be in the comment section or in the description below. Um, also, if you go to my actual profile on YouTube, I think there's a link to my Facebook there. Um, that's for more up-to-date 